Hello you guys and uh, welcome to a very special kind of video. As you can see I've got a package here. It says Hybel on it, so it's addressed to me. This is kind of a product review of sorts. I got contacted by someone from Luon or Vion. I have no idea how to say it, but uh, they make tablets and uh, they asked if I could do a review on their 420 model. So, of course, I just yes and jumped right into the opportunity. All right. There we go. Who Eon? Who Eon? That Chinese symbol. They actually advertised the damn thing as a Oso tablet. Look at it. A pen signer for drawing and writing. You you can get like two different variations. One with like three, I, I assume, reprogrammable buttons, but I'm not very sure. Usually you just press them and they do different stuff. You set that all up in the driver. Pen looks really good. I cannot wait to dig into this. It's out quite badly, but <laughs> whatever. There we go. I am going to enjoy this pen. I can already tell you. Because I always... Oh my Jesus. You can press this. That's awesome. <laughs> yes. This pen is like the best tablet pen I have ever held in my in my hands. <laughs> you don't click these keys by mistake, definitely. They are definitely made. Because I always, when I hold my pen, I always like hold my finger on one button and I always seem to click it and then it, it disturbs my play and stuff. If you never got a tablet before, you always get these. It's like, if for some reason you destroy this, where's my camera? There it is. This tip of the pen, it, it wears off if you draw. And of course it wears off very fast if you play also and you don't hover. So you can replace your tips. They're all the same kind, so it's all the same as it's as in the tablet itself. This is actually very small. Yep. This is like half the size of what I usually use. But keep in mind that the actual playing field is only like this big. You're not going to play with this whole thing. You are only going to play with like this. So I might actually have to switch to full screen for when I play also now. Which is not a problem really. It, I only play window mode because I cannot find a perfect size for my tablet. So yeah. I mean, this is definitely packaged way better than with any other tablet that I have had. I have had. I have had, sorry. <laughs> and I've had like four different. This is my fifth. My fifth tablet. It's very light. But as long as you have a big mouse mat, then it's not going to slip anywhere. I have like four rubber, almost like sort of feet. Doesn't feel like it's going to bend anytime soon. So it's it's really good quality, and for the price, holy shit! Like like half the price of most tablets out there, and it's half the size as well. I don't know how much the the one with the buttons are. 
I got this one sent to me personally from the company from China. That was very nice of them. Again, I'm not being paid to do this review. I'm still going to give it a fair and honest opinion. So, yeah, initial reaction is I am very impressed. <laughs> Definitely. I mean, just that it says also on it, you mean, you know, you know, it's going to be geared towards it, towards it. I think it's the first company that I've seen that actually acknowledges and knows that people don't buy the small tablet and draw with it anymore. And not most people, I assume. If you're going to draw, your, you're going to need this, the size of a tablet. This is just for signing and very basic drawing and also there's really not much else to say. I like it. I like it. And the fact that it's so small, it's not going to waste any space at all. Where's the... Oh, it's on the side. You plug it in from the side. I personally would actually like to see it on the right side, on the front, sticking out. That would be very awesome. I mean, you could switch it, I assume, like just flip it and then go into left hand mode. Because there is, there is, of all the tablets that I've used, there's always a left hand mode. You just, you just have to like flip it around and then you, you just do it in left hand mode and then switch, use the right hand. If you want the right side, but that's just a personal thing because <laughs> my PC is over there. And the damn thing is out there, so... Oh well, I have lots of cords and wires, so... That shouldn't be a problem, really, but... It's just something to keep in mind, I guess. But I would wager that most people would like it either in the middle, sticking out, or to the right. But that's just a minor thing, really. You can get cheap wires for, like, no money at all. So I'm going to spend some time using this and reviewing this and giving it a fair review. But my um, initial reaction is that this is a damn fine packaging and product so far. Yeah! I actually forgot to mention something about the, uh, the pen. As you can see, you can screw this off and guess what? You need a AAA battery to to make it work. So yeah, just a heads up.
playing with this for about a week, I do think that I have a good understanding about the tablet and stuff. What I thought this was, like, I thought it was to take this tip in and out, but it's actually to turn the tablet on. See? Because it uses a battery, which... I hate to say it, but it kind of ruins the whole experience for me. Because the battery is in here, in the end. And this, it, it, it gets very, very heavy. Because without it, it actually feels very nice and light. And it's very easy to maneuver and move around and stuff. But as soon as you put that damn battery inside, it becomes pretty hard for me at least to to move properly because this side is so heavy compared to the tip so when you have to do very quick reaction movements then it's like this t this part here just doesn't want to move right but oh well that's actually the only problem I have with the tablet is the goddamn battery but I understand for the price range that this tablet has then if they were to use a wireless a wireless pen then the price would go significantly up. Also the size of the tablet. The size is actually pretty nice. I don't mind the size but I'm just used to use full area on a bigger tablet so Getting used to not playing, well, to be playing full area, but to, for the full area to be smaller, it's actually quite hard for me. But uh, I think I did pretty okay for the, the amount of time that I've been playing with this. I have not been playing with my other tablet at all, I've just been playing with this for a whole week. And yes, exactly as I said, then this, <laughs> having the, the thing come out of the left instead of in the middle or to the right for me is a pretty significant well not significant but whenever I want to play also I kind of have to my mic is in the way but I have to place it under here and then the wire goes over my keyboard you you have seen it in the gameplay bits but it's not annoying because it is so small so I can just move it away when I want to so it's not really a problem, I guess. But I will say that it is absolutely perfect for a beginner on Oso. If you've just started out and you think that a mouse won't do you any good anymore, then by all means, go buy this tablet. It's, it's cheap. It's like, what was it, 20 euros or 20 dollars or something? It's nothing. I mean, you can't really go wrong. If you don't like it, then you don't like using a tablet, and you should start stay with uh, a mouse, anyways. So, <laughs> but uh, I've been playing also for around five years, and this is the first time I've used a tablet this small. So, at least I have an excuse, I guess. But in conclusion, then. For this tablet, for the price range, I will give this a 4 out of 5, definitely. Because for the price that you are spending to get this tablet, it is really good. If this was like a $40 tablet or something, then um, you might want to look somewhere else for a tablet, I guess. <laughs> but $20, it's like, it's, it's good. It's a very good tablet for beginners. It is very responsive. That's, it has absolutely zero input lag. So it, if you move your, if you use, if you move your pen, the damn thing follows exactly what you're doing. It took me around four years to find a tablet that actually did that, and this is the second one. So good on you, Huyun. I can't even pronounce your name, but. Good on you. <laughs>